Are you kidding me right now? Where did he come from? I don't understand. Like, literally, he's not supposed to spawn in like that. The door behind me, it was... Yeah. Oh, well. Not going that way. We know that that's not the way. So, back this way. Alright, so we know that we're done with this end of the facility. It's over here. Another heavy containment zone. Maybe there's just multiple doors to the heavy containment zone. Maybe that's what it is. I do not know. Are you gonna mess with me? 106, huh? Huh? <laughs> Please don't. Alright, so now we're in this part of the facility. So, we didn't see the... Oh, wonderful. Wonderful, dude. We didn't see the new... Oh, wait, no, you're supposed to just run through. Okay. We didn't see the new SCPs yet. And the... In the light containment zone. So, that means that they may be heavy containment zone SCPs. Meaning that they're awesome SCPs. Dude, what the hell are these sounds? Oh my god, dude, I think we found something new. I hope that I'm not saving someone when I'm about to die. Wait, this looks like the room that had the zombie plague virus thing. What's going on? Push the button, but nothing happens. safely to the surface. Just find the control panel in there and open the chamber doors for me. Alright, dude, sure. Just, uh, let me read this piece of paper here for a second. Don't worry, I'm not checking it to see if you're, like, possessed or anything. I'm just curious as to what it might say. Cough, cough. In light of the mass well, suicide hum- for. In light of the mass suicide homicide of the members of the research team tasked with translating the passages garnered from SCP-035's containment cell. What? Do you not- Alright. I admit it. I wouldn't blame you if you don't think I look trustworthy. But please, I need your help, and quickly! The mask has been stuck to my face for some time now, and I think I might need medical attention, or it might kill me from the inside. Just let me out, and I can find us an exit in a matter of time. The morale damage in the area and general loss of staff dealing with SCP-035 to either death or insanity. It has been sad to coat the inner and outer walls of its containment cell with right, SCP-148. If you still don't think I'm trustworthy enough, there's a locked storage room behind you. You probably noticed that it's guarded with a four-digit passcode. Inside is some useful equipment, as well as a pill of SCP-500. The passcode is 5731. Got it? 5731. Five, Alright, dude. There's a monster in there that's gonna kill me, right? Let me finish reading this first, then I'll let that monster eat me, okay? Uh, uh which has proved well in the- I'm starting to lose my patience here. Dude, calm down. I just want to read this thing. You're not letting me read. Which has proved well in the containment of SCP-132. In order to hopefully block out the high levels of negativity being in mid I'm by- I'm just standing there. 035. The use of 148 has worked well, causing morale and suicide rates to return to near pre-SCP-035 rates. However, the material appears to be facilitate the negativity within the cell, causing a veritable greenhouse effect inside personnel inside the cell. Instead, they feel heavy sense of dread, fear, anger, and general depression, as well as hearing constant, nearly you inaudible know, whispering. The mobile task force will be entering the facility any minute now. Guess what they do to stray class Ds like you? Nearly an audible whispering from immediate entry. Uh, a prolonged uh, stay causes severe migraine, suicidal tendencies, heavy hemorrhaging of blood vessels around the eyes and inside the mouth and nose, general hosti hostility to others, and for the whispering to increase to almost deafening volumes. Alright, dude, I read it. I don't trust you. Did I just. Okay, good. I thought I picked it up again. 
Have anything to say, dude? I know that you're talking about how those mobile task force are gonna kill me. Five, seven, three, one, right? Don't worry, dude. I'm gonna open it. I'm gonna let that thing inside of there eat my soul, just like you want it to. Alright, it said that they coated the walls with another SCP. I wonder what that. Good luck getting out all on your own. Dude, did your voice just start to change? The mask is gonna change to, like, an evil mask, right? Like, he's getting upset now, he's getting angry, so the mask is gonna become evil. Dude, I know your secrets. What is that black stuff all over your shirt? Is that blood? Have you been eating people? Huh? Huh? Tell me, man. Oh my god, is this really happening? I don't get to enjoy the game because freaking man crazy comes. What's in here? There's nothing in here. He lied to me. He blatantly... Dude, you lied to me. You lied to me, dude. 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 He only kills me now. I don't get it. So is there anything else that, like, I can have happen with this guy? Maybe it was because of, uh... Let's see, 106 came and ruined everything. Oh, this is what it was, okay. I can open the door, I can turn on gas valves. Dude, the way he moves and stuff looks creepy as hell. Someone actually found me. I thought I was done for a moment there. I'd have to sit here for like 10 minutes to get through all of that again. Surface. Just find the control panel in there and open the chamber doors for me. Hey dude, look, I knew the code to this. I wonder how. Was that there before? Ah, oh, here we go. SCP-035 is to be kept within a hermetically sealed glass case no fewer than 10 centimeters, 4 inches thick. This case is to be contained within a steel... Iron... And lead shielded, uh, lost my room at all times. No fewer than two armed guards are to be posted at any time. Trained psychologist is to remain on site at all times. Anyone right. who comes in contact with SCP 035 when it is in the possession me. of a host is to be given an immediate pay psychological evaluation. Uh, 035 appears to be a white porcelain comedy mask, although at times it will change to tragedy. Highly corrosive and degenerative viscous liquid constantly seeps in the eye and mouth holes of. 035, anything coming, that must be what the, uh, what's on his shirt, anything coming into contact with the substance slowly decays over a period of time until it has decayed completely into a pool of the original contaminant. Glass seems to react the slowest to the effects of the item, hence the construction choice of its imme immediate container. Uh, subjects within 1.5 to 2 meters of SCP-035 or in visual contact with it experience a strong urge to put it on. When 035 is placed on the face of an individual, an alternate brain wave pattern from 035 overlaps that of the original host, effectively snuffing it out, causing brain death to the subject. Subject then claims to be the consciousness contained within 035. Psychological analysis has discovered 035 to possess a highly manipulative nature capable of forming sudden and profound changes to interviewer's psychological state. Uh, 035 has proven to be highly sadistic, prompting some to commit suicide. Wow. Alright, let's go drop that. And there's nothing in here. You talked about, like, SCP-500 was in here or something like that? Like a pillow? What did I just get? Oh, a pill! Not a pillow, a pill! Dude, what does the pill do? What is this, dude? Thinking about taking it. Oh, I feel better. Hey, man, I feel better now. I feel a lot better now. Fine. Good luck getting out all on your own. Dude. Your voice did change. I swear to God, if 106 shows up again, I want to see if he does something. Like, if he changes his face. He has to, right, guys? Maybe he changes his face when I open up the door. So I'm supposed to either gas him or release him. Oh, 106 is gonna show up. I don't have time. I'm just gonna... I'll release him the first time, then I'll gas him next time. Unfortunately, I never had any intentions of taking you with me. So this is where we part ways. 
but for the sake of my freedom. I have reason to believe that SCP-079 has taken control of the facility's systems, including the door system. Your best bet is to appeal to it somehow. Hopefully you can come to a compromise. However, it does not control the warheads, which you should disable remotely in the event that something goes wrong. Dang, dude. He just, like, he gave me the answers. Oh my god, dude. What's going on? What the hell? What? What? So yeah, they said they coded this thing with an SCP. Oh, yeah. Okay. Of course. I swear to God, dude. Can I kill uh, 106 like that? He's not in there, so he just walked through it. He doesn't care about the gases. Dude, I took that, uh, I took the SCP pill thing. You can't kill me, I took the pill. I don't know what that pill does. Maybe it's so I don't have the children or something. My god, dude. Alright, alright. Here we go. Load game. We're gonna see what happens if I gas him. I can't actually know. We're gonna see what happens if I release him, and then I go out to where I can, uh, come in contact with him. I'm surprised. See, like, whoa, the gas is still on. That's not cool. Oh, thank god. Someone actually found me. I thought, unfortunately, I never had any intentions of taking you with me. So this is where we part ways. But for the sake of my freedom. Oh uh, yeah, I can. I have reason to believe that SCP-079 has taken control of the facility's systems, including the door system. Your best bet is to appeal to it somehow. Hopefully you can come to a compromise. However, it does not control the warheads, which you should disable the moment in the that something goes wrong. Alright, so yeah, I can't run into him. I'm gonna let this thing kill me. Okay, interesting. Let's see what it says. And then we're gonna gas him. We'll need more than the regular cleaning team to take care of this. Two large and highly active tentacle-like appendages seem to have formed inside the chamber. Their level of their aggression is unlike anything we've seen before. It looks like they've beaten some unfortunate Class D to death at some point during the breach. Interesting. Interesting. Alright, so now we'll go ahead and gas the guy who's in there with the mask on. We'll see what happens. Maybe we're gonna get to, after we gas him and kill him, go into the chamber and put on the mask. I'm still not really sure about that, uh... The pill. What does that pill do? Oh, thank God. Wait, what the hell are you doing? What Don't worry about it. Please, please, good. Just please. I can't breathe. No. Dude, is he gonna die? That's like... So, you really don't want to leave this place alive, do you? You know there's no way a lone D-class like you will make it to the surface safely. Even if you did, they'd gun you down the moment you came across their reticles. Can I try to get me prepared on now? I'll give you one more chance here. Whoa. Just open the chamber doors Holy and we'll forget God. about this little gas incident. No way. Um, should I open them? Or Let's try opening it this time. We'll see what happens the next time when I gas him. I wonder if it's the same thing. Help, but I have no 
no further business with you. I have no intentions of taking a person who earned their imprisonment with me. But for the sake of my freedom, the simplest way for you to get out safely is to go and find SCP-012 in the light containment zone. If you can read between the lines, it'll be as interpretable as a map. Good luck. Whoa! Zero, one, two. If you can read between the lines, it'll be as interpretable as a map. Dude, whoa. It's crazy, now I need to die. And we're gonna gas him. What was I able to pick up right there? What the heck? Huh. Alright, this time we're gonna go ahead and gas him again, we'll see what happens. I'm loving how much, uh, they have to this guy. Like, lots of different, uh, what is it? Voice things. Dialogues. Alright, time for the really long death sequence. Here, one second guys, I need to pause the video for one moment.